Good afternoon, Dr. Gary here, Dr. Gary on the road. We sell dental practices nationwide. Today's topic is a little different. I just sort of a warning for some people out there. The title of today's topic is, do not take your mask off in the plane. We'll get into what happened incident. So, we've been doing dental practice sales nationwide. I'm a broker, nationwide dental practice sales for one, uh, 12 years now. I was a dentist for uh, 25. We have 10 employees, including two CPA accountants, marketing director, a operations director, and five uh, acquisition people, uh, specialists. So, you can reach us 24 seven, Usually we'll pick up the phones from 7.30 a.m. to 9.30 p.m. every day of the week except Christmas and Easter. So we're available to you. Just call us. We're also available before a sale and after a sale. If you're thinking about selling to a DSO, please call us because they will often pay our commission. And sometimes we can get your legal fees reimbursed at closing. So give us a call. Uh, all the information you're about to hear is uh, for entertainment purposes. It is not legal or business advice. So we're here to help you, here to assist you. Call us at any time. Anyway, the um, phone number to reach us is 201-663-0935. And the, our website is Dental Practice Guide. Dot com. So call us anytime. We're more than happy to help you. So what happened now? I know we're not, this is not the typical subject of our normal uh, YouTube. So I think we've got a break from that for a second because one of my accountants who was boosted, vaccinated and boosted, did not wear the mask on the plane. He was on a short, short trip. He got covid and wound up in the hospital. So I don't want that happening to any of my clients. Be very careful out there. I don't care what the government says. I don't care what the CD says. Don't take your mask off in the plane. Keep your mask on. He's in the hospital now because he took his mask off. Just because your neighbor sitting next to you six inches away takes a mask off doesn't mean that you're going to be healthy. Please listen to me and please... Please, don't take your mask off. In the plane, this is a lesson to be learned. Be careful out there. The second story, I just met a dentist today that had not been in the office for two weeks, had taken some time off and just did a staycation. Maybe in 10 days she wasn't in the office. She got COVID and she wasn't seeing patients. The office wasn't open for 10 days. And she believes within 24 to 48 hours of going to this restaurant that she got COVID. So I don't care who says what, um, it's still out there and you can't afford to be away from your office for, for two weeks being sick. And forget that stuff that, oh, it's only gonna be a little cold, a little sniffle. Well, this one doc, this one uh, uh, employee of mine wound up in the hospital and he was boosted and vaccinated. So be careful out there. Be re very careful out there. Don't just listen to any of your friends that are advising you. Don't worry about it. Masks do nothing. That I still feel personally that's ridiculous. You see patients wear a mask. Physicians in hospitals see patients that wear a mask. Nurses wear a mask. Wear the mask. I'm just trying to tell you from practical experience what has happened to two colleagues and hopefully you'll listen. It's only my opinion, but I'm giving you information from the front, which we often do. We try to tell you from the infantry, from the front lines, what is actually happening on a day in, day out basis. And this, a little different twist, something that's happening. All right, thank you, bye.